Hey guys, welcome back. This is the casual Dark Souls 3 playthrough. So, just continue where we left off. Come on. Oh my god, load. I'm so impatient. <laughs> okay. So, what did we do last time? I think we killed the old Demon King, right? And we upgraded this. Let me just check. Oh yeah, I need one more of them. Okay, 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 okay. Cool. Let's go back to wherever we were. Um, I think this would make sense to go down here a bit and explore the demon ruins and stuff, you know? Just keep it chill. Alright. It's weird that it makes me face towards the old Demon King, like, when I actually want to, you know, I think it's like the first bonfire of this area, so why would it, okay, well, whatever, let's just go down this way. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, man. Oh, wow, oh, oh wow, okay. They pack a mean punch. That's going to be a problem. What's he doing? Can I actually break these things? Oh shit. This is like literally the first enemy I'm fighting here. Oh wow, he missed. His, his swords like hitbox went over me. I was so close by. Oh man, they, 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 yeah, alright. They hit way harder than I expected with their fireballs that shoot stuff out. Oh, here's the stairs. Let's go down. Damn. Oh. Ah, uh, what a nasty trap. Okay, now maybe I can go down. Uh, yeah. Okay, I'm not fighting all of them. That would just be kind of crazy. Some stairs up somewhere. Oh, my God. Okay. These, these look just like reskins of the swamp. Oh, man. Everything here is, like, <laughs> hitting like a truck. I think that was a large titanite also. Hold up. Wow, a charged R2 didn't even kill him. Maybe I'm a bit weak. something. I don't know. Normally, I think you should be doing a little bit more damage, or maybe not, actually. Two-shotting enemies is probably like the right amount per area. Something like that. Isn't this where I came from? Uh, probably. Let's go the other way. Let's go up here. So I came from downstairs, and let's go then to the left. I think there is more stuff down there. I will check in a second. Maybe once I go back to the bonfire. Oh, hold up. Yeah, he's just sneaking up on me. And what what is this guy doing? Like, he's just chilling? <laughs> Oh, man. Oh. Oh, is that... I think that's a slime up there. Let me just kill it real quick. Come on. Oh, it's... It's fire. Okay, it's not gonna... 
Oh man. Of course. Wow. Put me in a gank I can't get out of, yep. Wow, this thing has a lot of HP. Hold up. Let's try another charged R2. I hear somebody walking around. Is this a... Nope. Uh... I mean, maybe it's possible. Let's see if I can... Okay, nice. That's the shard. Ooh, so it was worth coming here. Oh, let's just roll through here. No need to fight all of these. I don't have any spell that actually does good damage against them. Oh, a hidden wall. And a bonfire. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Let me grab that real quick. I'm going to go back down that hallway, though, and see what's the other way. Um, so the slimes were here on the left. Let's check what's over here. Oh! Ah, that's this... Okay. That leads right back to... Oh, well, actually, that's not too bad. I wanted to see what was down there. Oh, shit. There might be items or something. Oh, oh, oh. Wow. Those are really... Those fireball things are more annoying than the actual bad guys. Not gonna lie. Oh, man. Oh, man. Here. Oh, wow. Another hidden area. Oh, a black knight. Oh shit, he can also. Got him. Wow, this place is crazy. <laughs> it's like really keeping me on my toes here. All the craziness. Let me just check if everything is recording fine. Yep, looks good to me. A black knight sword, wow. Oh man. Could have put an item right here. That would have been a nice little, like, kind of Easter egg kind of thing. Or back there, you know? Oh, well. Let's go check out. I see there's a guy patrolling over there. That's kind of annoying. one guy coming towards me. Oh, they're easy to kill. Okay. The ones that crawl around. Same for these guys. Th those are from Dark Souls 1. Like, the exact same. Just their, you know, model looks a little bit better, probably. They always do this fire attack. I think they're meant to be, like, living statues. You know, like something like a gargoyle. Uh, but I'm not sure. I hear someone walking, but I don't see him. Oh, there he is. Yep, of course. Wrecked. Hold on. Let me check what's back here. Oh, there's another guy. What's he doing? Oh, poison again. Let me see if I can... Oh, shit. I can't see anything. I wonder if fire actually affects them. Mm, not that much. A little bit. Every single one of them drops a Titanite shard. Sweet. 
swing first if they run into you, you know, catch them off guard. Oh, is this just looping back to where I was? Yeah. So let's first explore inside here. Wow, this place is really confusing, by the way. An ember. Nice. I am embered up. Let me see what's over here, then. <coughs> oh, it loops back to the bonfire. Okay, okay. Nice one. So... Oh, okay, there's an item there, so I think I didn't go this way yet. Oh, come on. And that should be it. How many R1s was that? Probably like five. Pretty crazy. Oh, here's a guy right here. Yep, and another one. I don't even lock on. Oh, he's he's buffing? Oh shit. Yep, stamina management. Another pyromancy tome. Who is this supposed to be? Some kind of insect. I know down here there's like lava areas and stuff as well, so I want to go check that out. Let me see if... Sometimes also these, these could be hidden, hidden walls, so might as well just check it. Try pointless, yeah. Guess not. Oh, yeah, wait, here's one. Nope. Hmm. Okay, well, that was pretty much a dead end then, just to get that one item, Pyromancy Tome. Which is good, you know? Maybe it gives me even more spells. Oh, and it loops back to the... Wait, what? <laughs> I'm getting so confused. This area is terrible when it comes to, like, everything looking the exact same, you know? Let's try going downstairs now. I think I didn't go this way yet. Or maybe I did. Here's a guy. This was with the Black Knight? No. Uh, oh, I was here already. Hold on. Oh, he's chasing me? Whatever. Wow, this this area. I quite literally have no idea <laughs> where I'm going. Let me go back towards the bonfire, which was... Oh no. No, I'm lost. Maybe over here. Yeah, it was upstairs. So I think that's all explored. Maybe I need to go... There's a door here at the top, in the corner. A door right next to the bonfire, and that looks like it. So I just checked these ones. I think I did go down this one, right? That's where I came out of the one time. Yeah, 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 I did this... So, let's check what's over this way. Ah, and this leads back to the drop-down area with all the fireballs. And this is the... Okay. Um... There might be another path where the fireballs are down there, so... Oh! Oops! That was dumb. Uh, whoops. They have no poise. I hit them once and they get stunned. You can stun lock them.
Okay, he got me. He got me. That's the Black Knight area, right? So. And now we're back at the hallway, I think. Oh, here's another path. Yeah, let's go check what this is. Looks like a rat. It is a rat, yeah. And another path. Oh my god. I'll just go into every first path I find. Little sneak bastard jumping out from somewhere. Oh, nice. For once, they didn't lie. Oh, you know who this is. That's probably the body of Quelag. Or Quelana, yeah. Also, it could, also could be Quelana, it's true. Uh, this sucks, but I cannot. I probably cannot survive this just yet. I don't have enough HP and I don't have enough fire resistant gear, like the fire ring or something. So I'm just going to leave that stuff there. It's okay, I can always come back here now that I, now I know how to get there. It's just in the hallway and. Yeah. It's probably not anything I need anyway, so that's fine. There's a chonky bear rat down there. Big ass rat. Maybe I can just. Oh, sweet deal. Oh, oh, shit. Wow, like, well, how many are there? One, two, three, four, five. Plus the big one. Shit. Uh, okay. And they're still past that first rat, like, down the hallway. I didn't actually check that yet. Alright, let's try this one first. Lizards. I can hear them. This, like, this froggy guys, you know. Here's one. Oh, shit. Oh, he didn't even die in one hit. Usually they're kind of squishy because they have that nasty instant death. Yep, this stuff. Oh, shit. Let me out. Nope. 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 Oh, no. Now there's two of them. Three, four. Oh, shit. There's so many of them. What the hell? Maybe if you run this way. Oh! Three <laughs> three birds with one swing. Two hits. Yep. They go down. Oh, a Titanite scale. Very good. Need those in a moment. Oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. I think I know how you can get there. You have to go back a little bit. And then to the... It's a hidden wall, I think, here. Because it is, like, just here somewhere. Maybe this one? No, it's not this one, but there's a chest. Oh, shit, I should have checked the chain first, but it's okay. Three large... Nice. Probably here? Or, ah, you know what? Sometimes they put a wall behind the chest. Yup, there we go. I have to just drop down carefully. The Izalith staff. Alright. Good. Hopefully there's not too many more lizards. I think I killed them all. Um... Wait. One path leads to... There, there's like this bridge with a knight on it and lava and stuff. But one of these paths leads to... I think you get invaded. Yeah, this is the one that leads to the invasion. I don't think I want to go this way. Before I find a bonfire. Then I can go backwards, you know. Come back from the bonfire. Now I only have to worry about the stupid knight. He's, he's probably not too bad, I think. 
famous last words, right? Oh. Come on. Oh, shit. Yep, they're very aggressive. Oh, man. Come on. <laughs> this is gonna be annoying. Oh shit. I should have tried the roll R1, roll R1 tactic. Okay, well, whatever. Um, the worst part is now I have to remember how I got there. I think it was this way. And to save time, I can just drop down and heal myself, I suppose. some stamina here. Shit. He roll caught me. And here, there's this rat, right? Let's just check real quick what is over here. I think it's not the... Oh, there's... Oh, shit. You can just fall right into lava. That's great. Okay, he, he did that. Dumbass rat. <laughs> Killed himself. Oh, okay, it's the same way. It's the same way, yeah. And then it's going to be the ch chonky rat below. Or... Ah, here's the... What? Look at those teeth. Oh my god. Here, I think if I go this way, I don't have to kill as many of these um base basilisks. Come on. There we are. Let me out of the fog. There we go. They can't actually really hurt you, I think. They just hit you with their um, crap. Ooh, that was really close. Look, almost dead. Okay, let me grab my souls before I die. Whoop, one of them's following me. Here comes number two. No! Ooh, that was close. Let's see what he does. Maybe I can just walk up to him and bonk him. Yep. Okay. So, the knight. Maybe I won't give up so much ground this time. You see? The roll tactic. No! No, no, no! Oh, shit. Come on. This is okay. Whoa. Oh, shit. Sayonara. Oh, and he dropped an ember, and I still have seven flasks, so that's actually pretty good. I guess I could... Oh, uh, it's a long way up there, so I guess I could probably just try to fight this um, invader real quick. It doesn't matter if I die, because I can just make it back here easy-peasy. But now I think about, like, okay, that knight is just going to respawn if I go back, right? Or if I die. Um, so, oh, yep, here. Let's use one. Nice, full health, and a little bit extended as well. I might... Oh! He's not an invader, he's just there. Okay. I might as well. You see? The roll tactic. Wait for them to attack, roll into it. No, that was really dumb. And then we can just get him from a distance. Come on.
Oh no, I'm I'm one handing it. That's not good. Oh shit. Oh shit, what oh, no oh. So close. <sighs> He's done locked me to death. Okay, I can do this though. No problem. Actually it's probably safer if I just go down the hallway of slimes. Wait, where was... Oh, shit, now I totally fucked it up. Uh... Ow. Okay, I made it to the hallway, but now... <laughs> no, not again. I went the wrong way. Well, this seems to be the right place. Oh, shit. I'm trapped. I must kill. There we go. Whew, that was pretty desperate. I only have four flasks left. I screwed up the whole thing there. Let's let them chase me a bit. No, fuck. No. Oh, no. Arrgh, so frustrating. I totally screwed that up. Just because of the beginning where I fell down the wrong place. That hallway does not help me, right? So... Oh. Wait, which way is it now? Now I forget which way I have to go. I think it's this way. Rolling, rolling, rolling. No, that's not it. There we go. Gotta kill this little rat. I just realized I probably lost like 10,000 souls or something. Which sucks. Those other rats are pretty chill, right? Yeah. Oh no. Not again. There we go. How annoying. So actually, I don't need to be embered up, though. So that's good. But this guy hits like a truck, so I will probably just heal one time.
He missed. God, please, bro. Ooh, he got frost frostbitten. There we go. There we go. Let's go. Ooh, the fume ultra great sword. In Dark Souls 2, that was, like, one of the best weapons you could get. Because it had also really good defense, if I remember correctly. Let me check. It's been a while since I played Dark Souls 3. So I could be wrong. Yeah, look at that. 80% physical block. That's not bad. 50 strength. Oh, my God. But it has a str uh, scaling with um, strength with A. Stomp. Use one's weight to lunge forward with a low stance to increase poise, and follow with a crushing strong attack. That is actually a really cool weapon, but yeah, you have to put so many points into strength. Probably like, I don't know, 30, I guess, to two-hand it. That is also... I, I wonder what you need to upgrade that thing. It's probably not a standard weapon. If it was, I would laugh so hard, because, yeah... Now that means you could buff it and enchant it, but I doubt it. I think it's a special weapon, so... And also, he dropped a great shield. Oh, the knight again. Okay. What a... Pain in the ass. Come on. Yeah. Yeah, they... Oh, shit. Wait for him to, like, come and attack. Yeah, and now it's over. They're actually not that bad. I, I realized just now they will always try to hit you. And they move forward a tiny bit, so you can just walk backwards a tiny bit. And, yep, they will always... Probably always miss. Okay, let's climb up here. Now we're making some progress. But I lost 10,000 souls. It would be 18 now. Ah, so frustrating. Sometimes they do stuff like where you can drop down off the side and then pick up an item. Not here, though. Ah, yeah, exactly like that. So, I have to climb up this one twice. That's fine. Just drop down here. Dragon Rider bow. Okay. Okay. In Dark Souls 2, that was a really good bow um, that you could get from literally the Dragon Rider boss. You turn his soul into the bow. And it had, like, magic damage. So, early on, like an early bow, it's pretty good. Um, I remember I used it a lot. I'd Actually, that I should do a Dark Souls 2 playthrough. I never actually recorded a Dark Souls 2 playthrough. I beat the game, I think, twice. It's not my favorite, you know? It's not bad, but I just... I like the other Dark Souls games better. Where is the thing? Ah, there it is. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, that could be really useful, a Homeward Bone. I only have three flasks, so I should be a bit careful. Oh. Got me. Actually, let me use one. Now I have three potions. 
Where's the thing? Oh, skellies. Oh shit, there's two of them. No. Oh my god. Bro. Pretty sure once you kill these ones, they don't come back. <sighs> I have to deactivate that thing. Then I can explore the lake a little bit better without being shot at every t three seconds, you know, by these giant ass bolts. Can I? Oh, yeah. He's probably dead. Yep. I got the other one's attention. Come on. Also dead. Hmm. Knives would be come in handy here, I think, to get attention of enemies. Yeah, I don't want to fight both of them, so I just want to fight this one. There we go. Oh, shit. Yeah, damn. Like, look at the damage he did to me. Strong. Yeah, here's another one. Oh, he, is this a... Yep, this is one of them, too. Oh, come on. No. There was the stupid kick again. Oh, my God. There's the crossbow thing. Are there any more enemies, though? That's what I'm... Let me deactivate this thing real quick. Is there a lever here? Yeah. Okay, at least that's out of the way. <sighs> Terrible. <laughs> I think these guys are all dead. Mana restored. Oh, there's no soft landing here. Oh, ho, oh. damn it. Maybe I should use a bone. Unless there's item. This this I think is okay. Yeah. If there's probably no items, then I can just warp out of here. It's just these giant crabs, right? Yeah, okay. No need to risk my 10k. Um or actually how much do I need to level up now? Thirty okay, yeah, I can just sell some souls or something. Boom, out of here. <sighs> Almost 14, okay. Uh -huh. Oh, I have a 10,000 soul even. A couple of 10, oh, these are the, yeah, maybe I don't want to sell those. I need almost 14, so... 11... 
think I wanted to go for intelligence to be able to cast, right? I need six points. Oh, and also I need some more attunement. Attunement helps me out right now. Yeah, okay, whatever. I'll, I think I'll go with attunement. Gives me more mana and, yeah. Yeah, farewell. Uh -huh. 5,000 for the spell itself. And what else do we have here? 13, 13, 13. And what does Wrath of the Gods... Volnir's Holy Sword. That also could be cool. I never... Th some of these weapons I've never even used before, so... Um... It's for free. What's this one? Black Serpent. Slots used 1, 15, 15. Oh, this thing is really nasty in PvP because it follows the target a bit. It might be better than this. But I've had this one and I've never had this one, so... Hmm. Tricky. You can only buy one in the new game, you know. If you have to do new game plus in order to get more. Which is kind of annoying. The weight is only 7.5 also, which is not too bad. 13, 13, 13. Scales D, E, D. Very weird scaling. More Black Serpent. You need just one point in Intelligence and Faith. Mm. But I still think that it's it's more... It's better to, you know, invest in this one. This Chaos Bed Vestiges. Which is six points. Even though this is just one and one. Because I'm already at 14, right? And this is just 15, 15. Let me see with the fume sword. I wanted to see also if I can level some stuff up here real quick. I don't have any souls, but it's okay. I can maybe just eat some. It needs twinkling titanite. Oh, okay. So it's like a totally different path, which is nice. Then, yeah. What are these things? Rotten curved. Rotten Gru Curved Sword with Poison Buildup. Titanite, okay, weird. And then, um, this one, how much? Titanite, I need three more to get it to like plus three. Um, yeah, okay. Or maybe by then I find another weapon, you know. Um, I don't know yet. One of the weapons I would love, but I need then 40 strength, is um, the paired ringed knight swords. But those are like all the way at the end, literally at the end of the main game, and then all the way almost at the end of this DLC. So, yeah, I don't even have to really worry about those. Th th those require anyways probably like a respec just to use it. But the Fume Sword, actually, I don't know why, but it's, like, really catching my eye because I'm thinking it has such good defense that I could actually even use it as a shield. 80% physical is a lot. Is a lot. And the scaling with A, that is just... I, I'm pretty sure if I upgrade this thing, at some point it becomes S. So. Be careful like that. Oh, whoops, I forgot one last thing. Let me see. Yeah, I knew it. That's good. So far, I never ran out of mana, so... Because I had just one Estus Flask is enough. Maybe the next one I'll put two, but... Yeah. Maybe with Chaos... Also, maybe with the Chaos Bed, bed Vestiges, it will... You know, start to get more expensive or whatever. Ah, uh, wait. There's one more thing before I go. The glove. Ah, uh, I... <laughs> 300. Oh, okay. Do not what? 
Um, I'm at 279. I don't I have one of those like little tiny ones. Yeah, that's 50, I think. Perfect. Oops. Okay, and I need one more Titanite chunk in order to get it to plus seven. That's actually really good that I'm using all the standard Titanite, like so the Titanite uh, pieces, then large Titanite, and then Titanite chunks, all on the glove. So it's like I don't, I'm not like sort of having this issue where I have to compete between weapons and stuff. I mean, I could also level up the claymore or something like that, right? Okay. And what does he have for sale now? Chaos Firestorm, yeah, could be... I think the normal Firestorm is better. Or maybe that was in Dark Souls 1. I don't know. In one of them, it does more damage and it's just better. But Chaos Firestorm is also not bad. Again, needs two slots. That's so weird. Zero, zero for attribute requirements. What? <laughs> okay. Oh, and Poison Mist. Poison Mist would be very good, maybe against the Dancer. Great Chaos Fire Orb needs two slots. Again, zero, zero. 32. Wow. Wow, that's like almost triple of this one, you know? 28. Oh, no, okay, it's like double. A little bit more than a double. That's not so good. There was like a, a spell... Ah, uh, speaking of which, I never, I never got the sorcerer, or the, um, what's her face? There's like this one that sells miracles, right? I think I could do that if I can survive the drop. I could do that real quick, get them both. They're not that hard to get, so. Let's start with the sorcerer. He is in, no, in the, in here, in the woods. Um, yeah, I didn't fight the Crystal um, Sage yet either, so. I think it's this one. Nice axe. There's nothing wrong also with standard weapons. Like, I do like boss weapons like this better because they're more flashy. And they often have really cool um, special abilities, right? But standard weapons are also nice. I like dex weapons. Like Uchi Katana and stuff like that. Oh. Oh. Okay. So, I could get the items there also in a second, but first let's go get the sorcerer. That's what I came here for. It's just up the stairs. My little cat is sitting next to me. Psst, psst. I have a cat named Loki. All right, here. Very so that means well that your eye on you. Yep, that's it. Now he teleported back to um Firelink. Nice, good. Oh yeah, here we can test out our fire spell now. That dude's definitely winning in the speed department, but not even remotely close in the damage. Oh, there is a hole here as well. I think it takes you to this, where the, the sage ring was. Let's just get the items here. Who's actually shooting at me? Hmm. Weird. Somebody shooting at me. I don't know. Ah, oh, maybe this guy. Whoa. I think that's a crystal spear. Or just a normal soul spear. Those do a lot of damage as well. 
I mean, I have hardly any souls, so just for fun, I could try to kill the Crystal Sage. Maybe I will just clobber him. I'm here now, so, like, why not? There he is. No! I want to try a fully charged R2 on this guy to see how much damage it does. That was just a running R1. There he is. Oh, fuck. Stop it, you bitch. Oh, no poise, huh? Hold on. What the hell? You have some kind of, like, fucking laser beams. Here we go. No, oh, come on. Get wrecked, boy. Okay, he's dead. Like, I think next time I'm gonna kill him. Where is he? Here he is. Oh, it's the wrong one. He makes, like, mimics. Oh, shit. Wow, look at this. He's just, he's just straight up spamming me. There we go. Dead. Very easy. I think you're actually meant to kill him before uh, the Farron. Yeah, the, he only gives 8,000 souls. <laughs> not even, like, yeah. Not even close to level up. So, the next one I wanted to get was... Hold on. Uh, I think I could just drop down, probably, now. I might have enough HP. I just don't even really need miracles, so I don't even need to go get her. So, let's just leave it for now. All of this stuff, I think, is done. There is still, um... Not Volnir. Where was it? Not this either. Yeah, this one. If you go back out towards the Demon King, now I can explore this entire lake area. There there could be uh, some items just, like, floating around. Oh, shit. Is this the... This is the wrong one. It was this one. Yeah. Whoops. Oh no, this is... Oh no, this... Yeah, this this leads... Okay, this is okay. This also leads down there. Yeah, okay, cool. And then there's like... Weirdly, there's like these giant crabs everywhere. And now I can... Nice and calmly pick up all the items... Without any stress. Oh, uh, yeah, there was... I think there is something, like, right, like here. Yeah, see, there's, like, something below this. And you need to actually shoot the crossbow. You're supposed to get the crossbow to shoot you here, and it breaks the floor. So I might have missed some, like, item, but it's okay. It's I don't, I don't really mind. It's probably just some, like, Titanite or whatever. As long as it's not, like, you know, a bone shard, then I will cry. These ones are pretty chill. I think. So let's just not get them aggroed. Yeah, they're pretty calm. Chaos gem. Pretty sure there's nothing back there, so... Yep, don't mind me, I'm just walking through. Oh, 
one of them saw me. <laughs> His friend doesn't care. That's pretty funny. Weird. Some are more hostile than others, I guess. Let him go by, I'll grab the item then. That's super weird. Uh, what's back here? Nothing. Oh, shit. No reason to go back there. And then over here. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, shit. I'm dead. I'm hit mashing all the buttons. Maybe he lets me out. Oh shit, now there's two of them. Let's just make a run for it. There's probably not even an item back here, is there? Uh, there's no need to fight them. I wonder if they are strong enough to slam the floor. Let me see if I can pull one. Yeah, come over here, you dummy. No, no, come here. Yeah, good. Right here, right here. Slam me, right here. Right here, right here. Nope. Didn't work. Alright, I'm just going to ignore them. Check this side. I think that's a cave right there. Wasn't this where that... That mute guy... That kind of like crazy guy that follows the female knight around... He... He... He ends up here somehow? Okay, cool. A lizard. Nice. Ooh, twinkling. I'll take it. I think probably the ring swords also need twinkling. No. No, what the fuck? Titanite chunk. Nice. Or maybe not. Maybe I didn't do their quest. <laughs> I screwed it up and, yeah. And that's that. Because I, I was pretty sure that this guy would come here and you have to fight him 1v1. One, one one. Impossible. And I think that's pretty much it, though, for the lake. So now I can get out of here. There is that one thing under the ground, but I'm not sure how you can get there if the crossbow thing is deactivated. I always forget about it. I'll try to remind myself next time if I ever come here, like, hey, wait, don't, don't, uh, turn off the crossbow before you, you know, stand on that one specific place and let it break the ground. Yeah, I don't see any items. There might be some items hidden in nooks and crannies here and there, but I don't want to spend now, like, you know, the whole night looking for them. I'll go towards the demon uh, arena. Can look backwards a bit. This is where the worm was.
I have a feeling like because this all this stuff could be connected somehow to like Dark Souls One, right? Because uh, it's also taking place in Lord Lord Dran and all that. I think this is actually Lost Isolith, and for some reason there's no lava here anymore. It's like somebody drained all the lava. Maybe the first guy in the first game, like your character in the first game. But once the lava was drained, then all these trees could grow. And the trees, since the roots are in the ground, contain lava, right? It, it could be something like that. I don't know. The game is so vague and it doesn't tell you anything, but it's just my guess, you know? Like, it could be even the trees growing up from under um, Ash Lake, but... Pff, yeah, no idea. Um, but this is most definitely Lost Isolith, because also you pick up all these things like the Quailana thing, and that was, you know, Blight Town led to it. And yeah, Quailana was down there. So, yeah, no idea. Right. Past High Lord Volnir is um uh Irithyll of the Boreal Valley, this like very beautiful ice area with this castle, looks almost like Harry Potter or something, right? But you need a doll. And to get the doll, I think I have to go back here and now go to the where the sage was and go that other path. Um I'm just trying to remember if there was anything else, but I think that's pretty much it in this direction so yeah I'm gonna teleport to the crystal sage and then go up you know to the left up there and yeah do all that stuff oh yeah I know this there's another crystal lizard here somewhere this one I can get yup the other one might be a little bit harder to get because he probably will run away, but let's try. Nope, got him. Nice. More twinklings. I might save the twinklings for, you know, the the paired ringed swords. Okay, there's one of those guys. There's the fat lady there. Oh, there's two of those guys with the cages. Okay. Mm. You could argue that this is maybe not the... nicest of areas, but it's probably also not that bad. Okay, he... Oh! Maybe just one at a time. Okay, cool. Yep. Let me see if I can... Nice, yep. But now I have no stamina. <laughs> okay, good. Both of them down. Whoops. I slid down here. Ooh, maybe I can sneak up on her. Let me see if I can get close. If you just walk, they can't hear you sometimes. Very nice. She missed with her attack. So, that was the end of her. Deflated. And there should be a bonfire. Yep. Bonfire. Maybe it makes sense to rest here just to get... Yeah. My stats back. There's a dude right there. Okay. Look at him, he's trying always to throw. <laughs> Two can play at that game, buddy. Weak. Paladin's ashes. Mm-hmm. Alright. I think there was like a bandit or something that pops out here. Or it's on the stairs. There might be another one that just jumps out from the side. Gotta be careful. Oh, we could get the drop on the bandit maybe. 
Yeah, look at this. From up here, we can just do a, dr a, a drop attack. Yep, right there. Oh, whoops, right there. So, run, jump, and... <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Frostbitten. Wow, the frostbite did like... I don't know how much damage. A lot. That's... Th these guys are like... They remind me a lot like of the... So in Dark Souls 1, there's this forest, you know, where Sif lives in. Sif is that big wolf, right? And in the forest, there's a bunch of guys, like an invisible knight and a sorcerer dude. And actually a bandit that looks exactly like the bandit I just killed. With the spider shield and an axe. It's kind of funny. And here they have an assassin instead, like the one that was chucking knives at me. It's kind of funny. Maybe this is somehow... Nah, I, I don't think so. Actually, I would take that back. I don't think this is related to Sif's woods. But those enemies definitely reminded me of um, the ones from Dark Souls 1. Right, let's go. Oh, there's a dog. Shut up, dog. Oh, Archer. Oh, yeah. Lovely. Dogs and archers. The best combination, right? Probably here in the trenches it's a bit safer. Come here. Yeah, just stick to the wall. Should be pretty good. Oh, what? Okay. Sometimes you just have to... Focus the enemies, kill them one by one, just like that. And it does help that I have so much vigor. What's my what is my vigor actually real quick? Uh where does it say? Ah oh, there on the bottom left. Twenty three. Okay. Okay, it's not bad. What? I must have hit the button too fast. Here, check this out. Why can't I not lock on? Oh my god, the distance. <laughs> no chance. I think this guy's not hostile, but whatever. Let's just kill him. Angel ahead. I will go to the bonfire, but let me first just kill these guys. Wow. Oh, I missed one. There we go. Because of the Estus shard right there. Now I can go back to Firelink and then level up anyway. Was there... Nope. No items here. This is a funny kind of church because everything loops back in on it, you know? I was just thinking again, like, sometimes the graphics look sort of Borderland-esque. Like, they have these strong outlines. Like, just just look at these like candles and stuff. Or maybe I'm maybe I'm seeing things. For some reason, to me, it looks kind of like Borderland type graphics. You know, this this cartoony style. Maybe I should look and see if there's a mod that makes it look cartoony, just for fun. You know. Wait, you. Oh no 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 nope 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 nope. If if you talk to this guy, he's gonna warp you to um the DLC. This ice. This ice area with, you know, Sister Frida and stuff. Yeah, nope. No, no way. No way. And I'm not making that mistake again. I'm going to go there when I'm much higher level. Yeah, let's warp back real quick. Cleansing Chapel, it's called. Okay, that's good. 
it'd be cool to add like a black outline to all the things and then give it kind of more pastel type colors you know and maybe a little less light noise like the you know what i mean like make it just like flat lights not like and yeah then it will look like a cartoony game like borderlands i'm gonna check and see if there's like a mod for that since i'm playing on pc okay we can do one more of this i think it should give me one more yep that's that's all i need for two a uh, two min slots Oh, this guy is here. Let's talk to him. I knew it. Wow, you just keep talking to him and he gives you more and more crap. So, he gave me a Farron ring. What's that do? Oh, that's really good. That's like that's kind of like the same talisman I use in Elden Ring to reduce the FP costs when you do a skill. Lift chamber key. Oh, thank you, man. What is the lift chamber key for? T uh, key to the underground lift. Key to the room of the lift that descends to the deepest dungeon in Lothric. A surviving dark wraith from this wall there. Oh, this is Ah, I could do that real quick. That's that's in um the Lothar Castle. I know where that is. That's you know if you guys remember where that knight is patrolling. Yeah, you can go actually down there and fight a dark wraith. And there's some items or something, but yeah, nothing too exciting if I remember correct. So, wait, let me check my Nice. I can get my um pyromancy flame up to I guess plus seven. I have an Estes shard. Do I have a bone? I don't know. I'll check in a sec. Oh yeah, I do. Nice. Very good. <laughs> so now, let's put another mana potion, probably. I think I'll do like this for now. Did I ever get the lightning thing? Let me see. Mm, no. Hmm. I want I want the lightning one, so I can put on the claymore, make a lightning claymore. Oh yeah, first this guy. Nice. Do not. Oh, you open again. Let us. <laughs> he at some point learns this pestilent mist. This one. Oh, 30. Oh my god, it's so expensive. But this this thing, you can then easily kill the dancer with it. I guess I could try with the poison mist. Um, Since that's a pyromancy. But this would be actually better. You create a cloud, and when they walk in, it's just like draining their HP super fast and the dancer walks around very very slow so oh this is actually very good too spook is a good spell for um when you have to jump off somewhere high with this I could if I buy this I could go get the um come again what's her what's her name the the the, the lady that sells you miracles you know the faith one and here I could actually let me see oh hey man you can uh Okay. I I think next time he wants to go to Irithyll. That's why he doesn't right now do anything. And I wonder, can I actually still level up with this guy? Is he dead already? Oh no. I, I forgot, like, he dies at some point if you don't do his... Oh well. Maybe here was a... No. Oh man. He essentially gives you five free level ups at the cost of you becoming hollow but since you're wearing armor anyways <laughs> it doesn't matter you know you can't even see how the character looks underneath so i wouldn't even care ah. Gracious let's see what she sells now oh yeah there's also this key to a door in the undead sediment sewer 
that's 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 also another way to get um the miracle lady. Uh, yeah, I don't need to do that. What's it? There's no dark areas in this game, if I remember correctly. Boost damage absorption when HP is full. Okay. Ashen. Whatever. Um. I didn't kill any new bosses, did I? Steeped in strength. Oh yeah, the crystal stage, but yeah, I think he just gives you magic stuff, so I don't really care. Alright, let's go. <sighs> Let me see what I want to do. Um, we can quickly do this one. Just kill a dark wraith. It doesn't take, like, maybe two, three minutes. And just grab the items down there. I'm not afraid anymore. Easy. Yep, it's just down here. I think it's this one, yep. Cool. It's just a simple elevator. Takes you all the way down. And there's a dark wraith there. Maybe I can... I don't know if he will turn around right away. Let me see if I can sneak up and do a backstab. That would be hilarious. And if not, I will just quickly mash R1 to do... Look at this. Oh, didn't work. Three hits, dead. So easy. I think that item lets you invade indefinitely, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. This is, like, total trash, because this lets you just invade in indefinitely. And also, take a look at this. What's this remind you of? Did you see Berserk? Because, yeah, it looks exactly like the pendant, you know, that uh, Griffith wears. This creepy-looking eyeball. Now, I can do invasions if I want to be, like, a, you know, a pain in the ass to other players. I could try it once. Let me go near a bonfire, though, just in case I die. Five thousand souls. Yeah, it's okay, even if I lose. I'm just gonna sit at this bonfire up here. Yeah. Let's try an invasion. Just, just once. I doubt it will even work, but... No one plays online, or... Hmm. I guess... I mean, the red eye is active. Yeah. I don't think that many people are playing Dark Souls 3 anymore. There are still quite a few players playing Dark Souls um, 2, Scholar of the First Sin, because I played it a while back, and I remember there were a lot of invasions, lots of um, summon signs in front of bosses and stuff. But, yeah, it doesn't seem like that for Dark Souls 3. There's nothing going on. Okay, whatever. Let's travel to... 
cleansing chapel. By the way, that's also one of the end bosses, and his name is Gale. And yeah, as a boss, he's a real... Quite a challenge. Very difficult, actually. Definitely not a pushover. So... Oh wait, I didn't actually activate the drop-down ladder there, so it makes no sense to go that way just yet. I have to first go up. I think. Yeah, just zombies. They're not really worth your time. Not even worth fighting. And Elden Ring brought these guys back in, um... What's it called? Caria Lucaria? Whatever. Raya Lucaria? That Harry Potter school. I think there's infinite of these guys. Was there? No. <laughs> I thought that tombstone was like leading to another area. Oh, yeah. 427, I think. Crazy damage. Two items here. Mm -hmm. The only thing is there are these weird looking ones that are... They're not dangerous, but they're just... They can... Um, give you some kind of weird almost like a poison build up or a bleed build up yeah this one right here let me see if I can okay I stun locked it luckily if that one spits some crap on you you get like um, bleed bleed damage after some time yep yeah, there's another one the little guys I don't care so much I think there's a third one here who jumps around. Yep, up there. Here we go. Oh, and another one of these ones. And another one. You don't even have to lock on with this weapon. Oh, that was close. If you would have hit me, I would have gotten that, that weird-ass disease. Undead Bone Shard. Ooh. I think I forgot to burn the other one anyway. When I teleported out of Fire Link, I might have to go back just to burn it. Burn both of them now. Yup. That will put my Estus at plus six. Which means that that's like the amount it heals, you know? Not the actual amount of potions, but at the amount that it heals total. So it's very important as well. Because then you can take more and more damage and use it less and less because, you know, if you have just like, let's say, 30% of your health and it heals you 70%, yeah, you can just wait. Okay, cool. Now I made it actually to the part where you can kick a ladder down. Here somewhere. This is the shortcut. So if I die or I have to go back or whatever. Okay, good. Let's keep going. Yeah, I think I'm... I don't even need to use one potion yet. Take a little bit more damage, like when I'm around 50%, then I might use one. Okay, 
two rusted coins. This opens from the other side. It's also a shortcut, yeah. Okay, the archer's not there just yet. But there, an archer appears in the window now. Yep, there he is. He's waddling on over. Maybe I can kill him like this. Nope. Actually, now might be a good time to... Oh, I can't. Oh, damn it. I have to wait till this crap wears off. Come on. I can't hit him. Damn it. Oh, well. Let's just leave him there. Screw it. Come on. Okay. No backstabs today. The little guys dropped down here somewhere. Oh, there's one. Okay, I can one-shot them. Nice. Okay, that's going to be annoying. I'm going to kill this guy real quick. Otherwise, he might knock me off the edge or something. Yeah. Bam. So he does drop down. It's so annoying. Oh, yeah. 1,100 damage. Suiciding. How much HP do I have? 994. Okay, I gotta be a little bit careful. Pretty sure that can, like, maybe even one-shot me. Here's a guy. Yep. Another guy. Or, oh, here he was. Little guy. I heard your chains. I kind of panic rolled there, but I heard the chains, so I was like, okay. Most likely he's close. Let me see if this... Yeah. Oh, man. I hear the chain guy. He's probably right behind me somewhere. trash out these trash mobs uh, and there's a fat lady I think so maybe oh I can't even lock on no the suicide oh that was really close too close for comfort okay I'm still doing good still okay Hold on, I know. There is a guy behind here somewhere. Or maybe not yet. He drops down from be behind you and tries to backstab you. Maybe it's this one right here. Yep. Oh no. Whatever. Oops, I screwed it up. I should have went under there and then rolled back while they're falling down, so sort of like make them waste time. Wait, what? No, it's not this. It's not that way. I think it Wait, how do I Wait, where do I go? What the hell? Ah, here. Here's a way. Bye-bye.
man, they do a lot of damage, these little... ...little weasels. But I can one-shot them, I think. Yeah. No chance. Come on. If I see them, I can snipe them. No problem. No problem at all. Oh no. No healing. And there's nothing even up here, right? Okay, fine. Waste of time. Firebombs. Maybe I could try killing them with a kukuri? Wow. The damage is not bad. Not today. I'm very close to the door um, that I showed before, the shortcut door. Nothing out on the balcony. Okay. And this balcony, also nothing, right? Nope. <laughs> so stupid. Suiciders. Yeah, this guy's a trick. Not gonna fall for it. Oh, actually something funny is you could leave the door closed, get all the mobs over there to start to chase you. And then open the door, and they, like, suicide and blow themselves up, but you're, like, having this invincibility animation of opening the door. Maybe there's another door. Wait, let me see. I think there was another door here somewhere. Oh, no, maybe not. Let me just kill this guy. Maybe I can get a two-for-one deal. Yup. use it because I'm already embered. Embers are great because they can actually act as the last resort potion, you know? Like, if you have, like, even just 10 HP left, <laughs> you could still use an ember to give yourself some more. Can I actually... I wonder if I can actually hit him from here. Oh, yeah, no. The wall is too high. Or... Wait, this is perfect for this. Yeah. Why waste time? Oh. There's another one right here. Oh, and another, a third one. Must have missed him. I didn't see that one. Where where did that one come from? Whatever. Yup, shortcut. This probably leads us back to the church. Let me check. Which is good, because then I can level up and... Yeah, I have more than enough. Just by 300... Uh, were there enemies here? No. Hmm. No items either. I think this is just the church. Yep. 
Yep. Okay, from this side. Nice one. It's just one level, but, you know, might as well do it. Alright, now I think I should probably try to get the intelligence up to get five more levels after this. It's starting to get really expensive, but whatever. It's all worth it just to get that one spell. That spell is so crazy good. Let me see. I need about 15,000 to level up. I could just sell these three. something. Okay, I'll just do 400. I don't have to go back. I know which one it is. It's this one, right? Yep. See? Sometimes it's worth it. Now, six. And the... Oh, yeah, the two bone shards. Let's not forget that. Plus five. Plus six. It's going very good in this file. I have the armor that I love. I have a very nice weapon. Overall, I'm very pleased. My HP is good. The only thing that's a little bit lacking is the mana and the stamina, but it's not bad. I can I can work with it, you know. So yeah. How heavy is this? Seventeen, and how much is the fume sword? Just just out of curiosity, you know. Wow, twenty-five. It's really heavy. Then again, it is. It looks like it's just made out of pure stone, right? So. I think the giant wakes up now? Yeah. Damn it. Can I actually hit him? No. Let me see if he doesn't attack. Hold on. Let's get him to attack, and then I'll just try... <laughs> he smashes you. Oh, you cannot roll that? Oh yeah, you can. Just one R1, otherwise it's a waste. I could just keep getting him to... do his palm slap thing. Yeah, I'm getting greedy now. Oh, he tries to grab you even. Man, he's annoying. Once with the left, twice with the right. Wait, let me heal up. When you kill them, they're dead forever, so... Let's 
Sayonara. Ha <laughs> ha. See you later, sucker. That's one giant down. Lloyd's ring? Oh, that's also pretty cool if you have full HP. It's like the liter the exact opposite of the red tear stone ring. I think he drops down. Yeah. And this guy. Nice. And I hear the fat lady with her plong plong with her weapon that's kind of like mine actually. There's this chain dudes here, the little guys. The little weasels, where are they? You can actually snipe some of them, I think. Yep, there's one. Why can't I not lock on? Cool. I guess the other ones... Yep, there's one. Quick run and attack. Mm, this one didn't see me. There she is, I hear her. She's really close, actually. She's right above me, probably. Evangelist hat and clo pants. She evangelizes with violence. <laughs> Good, she's dead now. Let's slide on down. By the way, I don't know if, if you've seen one of my other videos I made. I found a Dark Souls 3 chest in Elden Ring. And... Elden Ring has, like, very unique-looking chests. But I found one place somewhere on this tower um, near Leandel up there. And it's, like, literally they just used a Dark Souls 3 chest, I think, by accident. Um, which is kind of funny. Because you can see, like, the asset, also the, the quality and stuff is, like, this old-school graphics. Like, not old-school graphics, but, like, lower-quality graphics like this one, this game has. It's kind of funny. Oh, there's a dude here. Okay. Oh, he's buffing. Okay. Let's see what he does. I think the roll R1 will be good here. Yup. Oh, what was that? He drops some mine or something, like a little light that explodes. Okay, well that caught me off guard. Oh, I remember this from the from the the pyromancer. There's like this creature that drops down here. Where is it? Okay, well maybe I can quickly grab the ring or whatever it was. Oh, it's just an ember. There he is. Look at that shit. What is that even? fight that directly because yeah he's spitting like that poison gas that can pretty much one shot you right so yeah not worth my risking now dying for no reason really to a stupid creature like that um, that's a mimic I think that's a mimic yeah Got him. So, 
So another tome for the miracle uh, lady. Ah, I could have... I think I made that mistake also in the Pyromancer thing. You could just come down here and then you don't take fall damage. Whatever. It's very unimportant. Then let's go up here. Soon we meet patches. Okay, just one of these little guys. No, not now. Longfinger? Lonefinger? What was his name? Oh, there he is. Oh, I think it's just an NPC. Oh, yeah. Frostbite. Oh, man, he's very easy. He didn't even block or try to uh, parry. Nice. That dude replenished my potions and mana and stuff. Oh, man. Let me go back on the land. Can go, like, this way. It's faster. Oh, not really. Imagine this was also poison. How annoying that would be. Dung pie. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get this one here. Ah. Also from Dark Souls 1. Yo, wait, what? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I think there's. This is kind of a dead end. It just leads to some items. But that's fine. Open it. Okay, cool. No enemies, right? No. Saint? Saint? Is that a weapon, or...? I think it's a spear. Yep, a spear. Charge. Nice, yeah, good. If a ma like a magic spear. Um, For some reason it has faith, but it doesn't have any scaling with lightning or anything, so... Pfft. What? Ah, uh, maybe it's made for, like, faith users, because it's, like, C scaling and faith. Yeah, I don't, actually don't get this one. Mm, they give you homeward bones. Maybe they're like, okay, go back now. But no, I'm not gonna. I still have five potions. And even two mana potions. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Let's try this side. Oh my god. <laughs> There is something you can actually do here. Do I have a dagger? Yeah, this has quick step on it, but do I have one that's... Then you can just do this, you know? Oh, no. Gotta put this away. Nice. That's way faster. Oh, this guy. Let me get some stamina back, yeah. Nice! Don't get caught in the acid. Oh shit. Maybe I can go around. Yeah. That 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 acid will break your, you know, weapons. Not fast, but you know. It's still annoying. So I pulled a lever and 
I didn't even see him. I just swung because I heard him. And now a bridge thing is up there, which is good. I'm going to go this way. I think this opens another shortcut. Bonfire head. Yep, exactly. It leads you back. Um, to here. To the church. Wait, let me see. I'm wondering if if I go here, if I drop down here, am I stuck down here? Oh, I know where this is. Oh, yeah, I forgot to come this way last time, but okay, I can grab all that stuff later. It's not important. So what does this door do? Maybe this leads outside? No. Oh, it leads back to the church. Okay, that's good. I don't need to rest, though. I don't want to now respawn all the enemies for no reason. Let's see where this takes us. Up. Mm-hmm. Oh, there's a guy here. Oh, and there's a bridge or something you can drop down to. Or, yeah, let's go up first. Oh, I thought that was an item. It's just a candle. Ah, this also gives you an attunement slot. Interesting. This, if I roll here onto this, this is just going to lead me back to the whole roof area, which, yeah, obviously I don't want to do that. And over here. No, it's, I, I'm more curious about the bridge, but I think the bridge also is just the roof area, right? It's like the lower roof. Let me take a look. Yeah, ah, uh, I know exactly where we are. That's the That was the guy that was shooting at me and giving me pain in the ass, like... You know, the the crossbow guy right here. Yep. Revenge, right? Vision of fewer time for revenge. Nice. So actually this elevator is kinda useless. Hello. That's my little dog next to me here. Whoops. Whatever. Let's Hmm. Rest at the bonfire or keep going? <laughs> That's the question, because yeah, maybe I'll go back. Uh, it's it's better to level up. With that many souls, like 19,000. That's that's maybe even close to two level ups. Oh no, it's just one. Okay, whatever. It's fine. Some more intelligence, I think. Three more. Just three more. I could already buy that. I don't know, I'll just I'll just wait. Maybe not, maybe not. There's another boss coming up soon. It's these deacons of the deep. Very, very easy boss. You just have to kill one specific hollow enemy again and again. And yeah, that's literally it. It's over very, very fast. So Oh, my dog is whining here. Go away. Maybe I can maybe I can kill this thing. No. Uh oh now I'm gonna get yep. This bleed stuff. Maybe. Yeah, I got rid of it. Can explore here a little bit. There's some items and stuff. Yeah, poison bite. Fine. And how do I get out of here? This way? I think that's a crystal lizard. Like the big ones, I mean. Alright, let's try to kill him. Yep. 
Yeah. Come on. Yes. It's over. He didn't even get one attack. Nice. Wasn't there a second one here? No, just one, right? Oh, this doesn't even hurt you. <laughs> it's a really good sound effect. I love that noise it makes. Okay, I'm going to make a small break for a second. I'll be right back. So, yeah, just just give me one minute. Skip ahead in the video. All right, I'm back. Just had to make a quick bathroom break. Anyway. <laughs> um, let's keep going. I'm going to explore up this way first. There could be something up here. I thought there would be two crystal lizards, but maybe I'm wrong. Okay. Oh, there's another one of those creatures slithering around. How annoying. Oh, the shortcut is here. Nice. Let me see if I can... Let it do its attack? Yeah. And then we can just probably... Oh, no. It has very high poise. Like, it just poised through everything I did. even another one. They make me waste all my, um, even two of them. Oh, man. Okay. Maybe I can kill the next one before I use this healing item. No, I think it's gonna affect me. Come on. Come on. There we go. I did get blood lost, though. Ah, sucks. But I can b always buy more of these blood loss things. Alright. Come here, you little guy. Another twinkling. Good one. Oop, I nearly ran past this. Okay, it's just tight night shard though, but whatever. Let's see here. I think it just loops back. Yeah. Okay, it's just looping back on itself. Because this is the crystal lizard. So, wait, if I go up and then... Don't climb the ladder, but go just back to the church. That would be the easiest, I think. So, wait, let me see which way I went. I think it was here. Or, ah, oh, you cannot go back to church because you dropped down. Ah, okay, well, then, then we have to go this way. No big deal. Or, you know what? Just to save some time, why not just... Um, yeah. Just use this. <laughs> 
One way to get him to shut up is just go to the <laughs> go to the DLC place and then just leave. All right, let's go back up here. There must be a way. I I think I have to still clear out this other area where there's. Um. Oh wait, what? Yeah, okay, they're just going that way. Yep, this is this way over here. I can kill this giant as well. But he's a little bit harder. Because he's also in a swamp. Maybe I can sort of... Ah, there's also these little creatures here. Fine, let me kill this. Maybe I can hit him and he, he gets aggressive. Yeah, nice. Alright, come over here, big boy. Yeah, come on to dry land. That's good. No, where's he going? No. Oh, he's throwing, like, the swamp stuff at me. Oh, shit. Got him. Okay, that's good. Ah, these... These things. Man, are these things annoying. gloves okay all the drang stuff drang helmet probably yo what the fuck some kind of worm drang hammers god drang it one cast of the fireball, which is nice. Before I use a mana potion. Because I have such high... You know, I have plus six on the Estus flask and the Ashen Estus flask that it makes no sense if I, um... You know, drink it. Oh, what's this do? Oh, no. Did I trap myself? Oh, no, wait. I can go through here. Nice. Oh, it's like bridges leading you, you know, across. But I think that Patches comes eventually. And he's a real annoying dude. He might be worth just outright killing. Just just to get him out of the way. I might just kill him so he doesn't put the bridge down and he also doesn't mess with me when I go in that tower and stuff. Because I don't actually think he sells anything that I need. Oh, no. Let me see if I can... I don't care about this guy. I want this guy to come over here. There we go. Oh, shit. What? There's one more. There we go. They hit really hard. But, you know. They're killable. All these losers are killable. Oh. 
That was a knight. I didn't expect that to be a knight. Ember. Good. A decon robe. Oh, and I forgot, like... Or deacon. Deacon robe. Decon. Recon. Quit praying. Well. Let me try the other side. There might be an item. Nope. So. Okay, I have seven Estes. In theory, I could just try to fight them. And Oh, cool. What's this? Horus the Hushed. Who's this? I actually never summoned anyone here before. This is the first time I'm ever summoning something for Deacons of this. Oh, it's both of them. The girl and the... And her knight. Cool stuff. Do they actually, like... If I wave, do they wave back? No. <laughs> he just walks off. I never... S well, this fight is anyway super duper easy. But I never summoned anyone. That's cool. That's that's a surprise for me. Alright, this is so easy. You just run towards the glowy red one. This one right here. And hit him. Until he's dead. That's it. That's literally all you do. And then there's this fireball thing. That goes up in the air. And comes back down somewhere. There he is. He's in the back. Right here. Bang. Bong. And then the red thing goes up. And the red thing comes down. Oh man, look at this. Where is he? Hmm. Ah, here. He's right here. I mean, you could in theory run out of potions, I guess. <laughs> oh, the fight is harder actually with them. Because the guys have more HP. Uh, the blue ones. You gotta kill the blue ones. Oh, shit. Oh, man, they have this force, or whatever it's called. There we go. That's it. That's the fight. Very, very easy. Even without... These two, these two didn't even help me at all. <laughs> 10,000 souls. Nice. Now I can level up twice. Oh, I thought there was an item back here. And they give you the doll. And the doll is important because, um... Yeah, you need that for Irithyll, where we have to go next. So, I'm just gonna... Warp. Where is she? Up. Oh, she's just sitting here peacefully. Oh, man, you don't have to stand up. Can't you just... Okay, here, look. Boom, boom. Oh! Oh, man. Not enough to level up twice. I need 5,000 souls or something like that. Which is good, because then I can already now buy this... Oh, who's this guy? <laughs> he just grunts at you. Alright. What? What is required? Additional items required? Soul of the old demon king. Huh? But I... I killed the old demon king. What? Now, now. 
Where are my items going? I did I didn't even use it. Huh? What? No, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, what is going on here? I'm going to later really rewatch my videos and stuff because there's no way that I sold it or just consumed it. Or maybe it's in my box. Maybe I put it by accident in the box or something. What? Huh? No, not a tune. Um. How do you switch? What? There's no way that I by accidentally sold it, right? No way. <gasps> the game is glitched. It has to be glitched. There's there's no way I would have I was saving up for that. Well, Wait, let me d let me double check this. Maybe it maybe it is a different boss. Let me see. Oh shit, I fell down. I can't talk to him. Okay, wait. Ah, the old demon king. Maybe that means this. Yeah, like Aldrich, this this dragon. Maybe he's the one who sells it. Ah, so. But I'm pretty. Wait. Chaos bed. Chaos bed vestiges. Soul of the old demon king. And what was the other one that? No, not the old. Ah, there's this old king. No, that's also soul of the old demon king. But I killed the old demon king yesterday. I I even I remember I summoned in somebody and we fought him together. What? I have this. I have the boulder here, but I don't have this. Oh man, this really almost pisses me off because it doesn't make any sense. Hold on. Let me check. Hmm. I'm trying to remember. M maybe maybe I didn't maybe it didn't register or something. Wait, let me see if I go back to Old Demon King, yeah. I didn't get my item. Man, the game must have glitched or something. For real. That's so annoying. Because I'm like fairly certain I didn't use it or sell it. No way I sold it. Oh well. I mean, I can sit here and cry about it, or I can just keep playing because, yeah, there's it's gone then. Um, hmm. I could, in theory, I think I might have some kind of editor. I have to check and see if I have the editor. I could just give myself the soul because that's not fair. The game glitched and I lost the soul. Oh, let's hear something. Hmm. Oh man, I'm I'm legit confused about that. There's no way I I I sold souls to the old lady, but I never sold uh a big soul, I think. Hmm. Very 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 weird. Very weird. It's kind of sad actually. Hmm. Oh god, I hope I didn't by accident, like, buy the stupid weapon. Let me just double check. No, I think it was a club. It would be here. Yeah, no, I didn't. Yeah, see, that doesn't make any sense. Unless I consumed the soul by accident. Or sold it by accident, which I'm fairly certain I didn't. I should have it still. Well, that sucks. All right, let's just keep going. If I see um, patches, I'm gonna murder him. 
take take my frustrations out on patches. I think he is up here somewhere. The door. Yep. This this is one of those doors that leads back also to a shortcut. This leads back to the front of the castle. And to the ladder that goes down to those slithering guys. So that's a shortcut for sure. There he is. I'm just going to kill him. He's so annoying. Keep keep guzzling. Oh. Oh, he rolls actually really fast. Come on, roll. Oh. Oh shit, I need to heal. The reason I killed him was because he stole the armor from my friend. <laughs> Onion bro. And I don't like that kind of thing. And also there's another reason. If 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 he's alive and you try to cross this bridge right here, he lowers it. And they have to go all the way around. It's so annoying. Oh. Is this an this is an enemy, right? Yeah. Uh, here I can actually respec somewhere. There's this um, this girl that you know you can give her one of those tongues, those pale tongue things, and then respec. But I have to be super careful because I don't want to you know waste uh, waste it. I think you only get like three unless you invade. Yeah, they're spitting some kind of shit at me. Oh, wow. So many of them. Oh, no, no, no. Disgusting creatures. Oh, you can break them. <laughs> nice. It's not like I really need magic anyways, so I could, in theory, even just drop the pyromancy glove since I did that in my last playthrough. And if I respec, I can put, like, everything into strength. I need... F I think it's 40 and... 40 strength and 15 dex for the... Paired ringed knight swords, right? The, um, yeah, that you get all the way at the end of the game. But with 40, I could probably even use then this fume sword. But right now, I don't really want to respect because I'm doing okay. And, yeah, I mean, the damage is not great, but whatever. Ah, with all this money, with all these souls, I can go and buy chaos. Fireball instead of Fire Orb. Let me see how much mana I have. 114. Yeah, okay, but then I would probably need three potions because you run out way faster. Uh, wait, where do I have to go now? I came from over there. 
Wait, 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 wait. Which way is it? There's just only to the... Oh, that's it. That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There is nothing else. Bonk. Just bonk everything. Everything dead. Um. Wait, let me think. I think there was also a kind of hidden area, right, where you can drop down onto these, onto these brown things like that. Yeah, you can go up there somehow, but I don't remember exactly. How do you go up there? Wait, let me double check. Maybe there's a ladder over here or something, because I forgot. I really forgot. No, there's no ladder here. Uh, hmm. You would think you'd be able to just climb up the vines, right? Like, it's almost like a ladder. No. Maybe there was a ladder over here somewhere? Uh, no. No way. There's no way I can jump that. Get it. But how do you get up there? Oh, I forgot. I clean forgot how you get up there. Uh hmm. My cat is meowing there in the background. I don't know if you can hear him. He's always playing with this um poodle. We have a poodle a toy poodle also. They always are playing so funny together because they're actually the same size pretty much the cat is even bigger just in case you hear the noise in the background I think I'm pretty much done with this area for now until I want to respec which actually I might consider at some point because I wasted a lot of points now on intelligence or whatever and I don't even need it Is that guy? Oh, that guy's still chasing me down, huh? <laughs> I'm telling you, like, because I'm wearing this armor, I think I'm a little bit more chonky, you know? I can take some hits. It was really worth getting the armor. So, oh cool, yeah, I have Ro Rosaria's bedchamber, which is good, because I can warp there and then immediately change to whatever I want. Wait, so wait, uh, now I have the doll, so I think I have to go back to, you know, the, the Boreal Valley. Well, let me go back first to Fire Link, and also let me check the time. Yeah, it's kind of late, so I might slowly wrap it up. Before I level up, I'm going to go see how much it costs to buy maybe a Chaos Fireball instead of having... Because I have two slots, right? So I might as well take advantage of that. Or I can buy the Black Serpent, which is also quite powerful. Learn Pyromancy. Oh, it takes two slots. 32 FP. Yes! And 10,000. Wow, it's like, quite expensive. This one also is quite expensive. 3 FP, but it makes many pillars. So it's, it's actually more... Hmm. This, this could make me walk through the lava. Yeah, maybe I'll go for the Black Serpent instead. Because then I could also buy Poison Mist, right? We could try Fighting Dancer. I don't know if I can beat her. Let me get the Serpent. Oh, and do I have... No, I don't. I don't have any more. Bones or Estes shards. Yeah. So this is Soul of High Lord Walnir. 
15. Oh, it's just one point into faith. That's fine. I could probably get that. Or his sword, right? Mjolnir's holy sword. But I'm pretty happy with my bonk bonk hammer. Yeah, I think I'll, I'll, I'll buy this. Because I know it from PvP. It's really nasty. I barely used it because I felt so broken, you know? Like, almost like cheating. 17. Oh, I just need to use get 2,000 more souls. Let me do that real quick. 2,000 more. I could have by accident sold it like this, but, like, I don't... I don't think I was that dumb. It could be. I'm gonna check later and just give myself the damn soul. Because I'd rather have that. Actually, it might make sense not to <laughs> use it right now because I don't know. I could put this, and then then I would have to get two more levels just to use that. But I might have a tool that I can just give myself that soul. Hmm. That's so tricky. Well, just in case, I'll do this. And I can always just level up two more levels. It's no big deal. We can already attune this and this, which is good for Dancer. And yeah, I think that will be it for now. Thank you guys for watching. And yeah, I will see you in the next one. We're going to go up probably to Lothric Castle. Or we'll go into Irithyll, the Boreal Valley. One of those two. Maybe the castle because you can get chunks up there. Which is good then for the Pyromancy Glove. And probably more scales, right? So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!